This is a Venturi tube. I've got a source of uh, air that'll come in to this side of the tube. It'll pass through this region where the tube is wide, and then here where the tube is quite narrow, and then back to wide again. Since the same amount of air has to pass through this wide cross-section as passes through here, the, namely the volumetric flow rate has to be the same, the number of cubic centimeters per second passing this spot has to be the same as the um, volumetric flow rate that passes this spot. And because this spot, this spot has a smaller cross-sectional area, the air has to flow faster here. So we've got a high velocity region here, a low velocity region here. But Bernoulli's principle says that the higher the velocity, the lower the pressure. So in this spot here, contrary to what your intuition might say, instead of the pressure being high here, the pressure is actually low. <clears throat> and we can demonstrate that using this colored water. I filled the bottom of these, uh, this U-shaped this, uh, uh, glass tubing with water that has a little bit of food coloring added to it. What you'll see is uh, when we turn on the air, this uh, column of water in the middle will rise because the pressure here is lower and essentially acts as a suction for, um, for, for the water. So this one will rise higher than either the other, other two. So that's a Venturi tube, uh, a demonstration of the uh, Bernoulli's principle and um, very important in, in a lot of areas of fluid dynamics.